Hi guys. Hi. This series really gives women a chance to shine. I, I love the camaraderie between the teammates. So Darcy, I wanna ask you, did the actresses who played the Peaches have a similar experience working on the show? Yeah, I would say so. It kind of, you know, mirrored the show. Our 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 offset life was very um we we became a team pretty early on. We you know, we were practicing baseball together for months before we started shooting. So we had this very team energy going into the show. So when um when we shot, you know, in Pittsburgh, we 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 all came from LA and New York and you know, from all of the other places. So we were all in Pittsburgh for, for the first time together. And it, it really felt like we were this team at like summer camp and we would shoot during the day and then we'd hang out at night and we'd hang out on the weekends. And it was, it was, um, we kind of couldn't get enough of each other. Absolutely. Like hanging out with your best friends all day. And that's like your work. That's how it felt. And we had so many, oh my God, so many fun times on and off set. So much laughter. Like I, some of the funniest women I've ever worked with in my life. But yeah. It was awesome. So Melanie, who was the funniest cast member on the set? Oh, no. say, I think we can say it at the same time. One, two, three. Kate. Kate. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Kate is Kate just, who plays Shirley. She's an absolute clown. She is the funny. She is just always, always just like a second away from making us crack up whether it's on camera and we have to like yeah. reset and start over or off camera we're just like playing stupid games on set. <laughs> like she really is uh, she is one of the funniest people I've ever known and I know we got to Kate very easily but everybody was fun. like this that is, a, is a, this, this is a, a, a um a bunch of clowns a bunch of jokesters yeah. that were just trying to make each other laugh all the time and and keep it light and have fun and it was um you know, much to the like director's dismay, <laughs> wrangling us and quieting us down. We, it was like, yeah, it was like a bunch of kids. Um, and you know, we're adults, so we're adults. Yeah. We're kids. I want to ask you, how much baseball experience did you both have before signing on? Like, was it one of your skills on your resume? Actually, it is yeah. one of my skills on my resume. Is it on yours? No, but now I just realized I should put that on there. I, I mean, I have like in my little special skills place it says sports and then it says the sports <laughs> oh yeah <laughs> yeah anyway um i i melanie and i both played baseball as kids i continued a little i think a little longer than you right because i played through high school and then um uh you know we would we've talked about this we've both played in a game here and a game there like throughout our adult life but nothing nothing you know uh nothing regular so we could, you know, we could hit and we could throw, but we we trained for months with incredible coaches, Justine Siegel and her like amazing staff of these yeah. wonderful professional baseball women that, you know, took their time with us and, and were patient and gave us one-on-one -on -one coaching. And um, we really, everybody- were, Yeah, like they were so patient with us because a lot of us, you know, knew the basics and some people didn't know anything and they just like really rooting for us, like so encouraging. Even when I knew there were days where I looked like it looked terrible, the thing I just did, they're like, you're almost there, you know, like, really it, when I was down on myself, lifting me up, like th they, we were so lucky to have that group that was helping us. Like we could not have done it without them. No they way. Taught us, they taught us this thing that we sort of continue to use throughout the show, which was there, I, maybe this is a baseball thing that they do all the time, but if 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 they if one of the coaches saw someone on the field doing something, either a, they did something good, they tried to do something good, they you know attempt they 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 went outside of their comfort zone or whatever, they would yell out, "I see you," or like "I see you," kind of like a little like "Good job, I see what you're doing," and that would like <laughs> when you'd get an "I see you" from one of the coaches, it was like you know the best thing you could ever hear. So. So yeah, we continued, we continued to see each other, um, this cast, you know, very supportive group. And finally, last question, what would you like to see happen with your characters if there's a second season? Should we be so lucky? You know, I, I don't want to spoil anything for whoever hasn't seen it, but, but Melanie and I, Melanie and I play Greta and Joe, who are best friends and inseparable and soulmates. And we have a bit of a, a bit of a breakup that was very tumultuous and sad and dramatic. And um, 
at some point in the in the show this happens and i would really love to see you know <laughs> selfishly because i just want to keep working with melanie forever i would really love to see that relationship be very much yeah. repaired i'm dying to know what happens with greta and joe because it's such a complicated you know a love story in its own right the two of them and um yeah just to see like how how they would or could come back together or um or also like for Joe's sake, I'm interested to see like how she stands on her own two feet. That could be, that could be really cool to see too. So hopefully we get another one. <laughs> I hope so because I really loved it. I can't wait to see what happens with these characters in the second season. Hopefully there is one. I want to thank you both so much for chatting with me today about this series. Thank, thank you so much. Thanks for watching. If you're new to the channel or if you're returning, but you haven't hit that subscribe button yet, tap it now plus the notification bell in the top right-hand corner so you make sure you don't miss out on any new celebrity interviews. Also, hit the like button and tell me below in the comments, who's your favorite star? Who would you like to see me interview next? I'd love to hear from you.